Are you stopping when the red lights flash? Many Twin Falls drivers aren't stopping for school buses. Here's what the Twin Falls County Sheriff's Department sees out on the road. Sergeant Ken Mensel says this is an ongoing problem for the county. Last week, uh, one of our school districts in Twin Falls County reported that they had seven stop arm violations within a time frame of about three days. It's important that drivers aren't distracted and are paying attention. When the yellow lights flash, make sure you are slowing down and ready to stop once you see the red lights. When that bus is stopped and children are embarking or disembarking from the bus, it's something we need to just be very cautious about. Law enforcement takes these violations seriously and continues to hold drivers accountable. We will be following school buses, um, trying to uh, find those who are violating the stop arm, especially on those bus routes where it's problematic, which happens on your busier roadways like Highway 30, Addison Avenue, and, and trying to see what we can do to curb those violations from happening and get those to stop. Some buses have cameras that allow law enforcement officers to identify license plates. A lot of our school buses in the county have stop arm cameras, so when the school bus driver is out on their route and they come to a stop, um, there's a video camera attached to the side of the bus near the stop arm that is recording and it captures that violation. Those caught won't be getting off easy. We, along with so many other agencies, um, value our children and their safety. There aren't any warnings that are issued with that. Um, if, if we observe a violation of a school bus stop arm, uh, we're going to issue the citation. Bella Bright, Idaho News 6.